Gina Straub and I am the head grantee for the Student Achievement Project. I work at Northbrook Elementary and I teach music there and I am in Vail, North Carolina. I wanted to motivate students to learn how to enjoy writing in their regular classroom and doing that I wanted to use music as a motivation because kids really like music. One, two, and three, four. Now listen to me clap this, okay? One, two, and four. Got it? Okay, so can we do that? Ready? So you got that? Starting in September, I worked with the fifth grade, and the fifth graders in their regular classroom wrote poetry. So they were able to use their poems for their project, and then we actually uh, wrote the rhythms in class. They um, worked on those together, and then they performed their rhythms and practiced their rhythms and read their stories aloud, so it helped them to uh, get a little more confidence that way, and then we recorded it all together. We're going to start out by recording Zachary's poem. When I point to you, Zachary, it'll be time to start your poem. Be loud and speak clearly, okay? Fall is time for school. Fall is time for Halloween and Thanksgiving. You always see pretty leaves, pumpkins, and scarecrows. Fall is unique. Fall is beautiful. So the next process is Zachary's going to have an instrument and he is going to uh, practice his rhythm and then we'll record his rhythm. Now we're going to add musical loops to it and he's going to listen and get to choose what he'd like to use for his composition. That one? Okay. Fall is time for school. Fall is time for Halloween and Thanksgiving. You always see pretty leaves, pumpkins, and scarecrows. My mom and dad got married on St. Patrick's Day. It was really special to me because my mom was so pretty and I got to be a flower girl. What is the most important thing you learned through this project? Um, about writing maybe because like you have to express your feelings in it, really how would you do it, mm -hmm. and then you had to put your beat into it, so that was a fun experiment, so. Good. And I learned that um, you should um, keep writing about your life because it's, it's cool because you can go back in your life and people can learn more about you. Good. Would you do this project again? Totally.